Hello, everyone, and welcome to morning prayer. If you'd like to follow along with this little service, a worship guide is available below. Today's readings from the daily lectionary are about life and death. Now, take a deep breath and let us pray. O oh Lord, open my lips. And my mouth shall proclaim your praise. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Son of Righteousness will arise with healing in his wings. O oh, come, let us worship and praise. Let us pray. We give thanks to you, Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have protected us through the night from all harm and danger. We ask that you would also protect us today from sin and all evil, so that our life and actions may please you. Into your hands we commend ourselves, our bodies, our souls, and all that is ours. Let your holy angel be with us, so the wicked foe may have no power over us. Amen. A reading from Ezekiel. But you, O mountains of Israel, shall shoot out your branches and yield your fruit to my people Israel, for they shall soon come home. See now, I am for you, I will turn to you, and you shall be tilled and sown, and I will multiply your population the whole house of Israel, all of it, the towns shall be inhabited and the waste places rebuilt. And I will multiply human beings and animals upon you. They shall increase and be fruitful. And I will cause you to be inhabited as in your former times and will do more good to you than ever before. Then you shall know that I am the Lord. I will lead people upon you, my people Israel, and they shall possess you, and you shall be their inheritance. No longer shall you bereave them of children. Thus says the Lord God, because they say to you, you devour people, and you bereave your nation of children, Therefore, you shall no longer devour people and no longer bereave your children of a nation, says the Lord God. And no longer will I let you hear the insults of the nations. No longer shall you bear the disgrace of the peoples. And no longer shall you cause your nation to stumble, says the Lord God. Long ago, God spoke to our ancestors in many and various ways by the prophets. But in these last days, God has spoken to us by the Son. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us. To shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Lord, remember us in your kingdom and teach us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God.